Today is the day that I finally have time to get to these boxes that are stacked all over my apartment now. Um, these are boxes that have been in storage for 10 years. I do not know what's in many of them, even though some of them actually have labels that say like books and family and... I'm really strangely excited about this process. I have no idea what this is. Oh boy. Oh, no, it's not broken. <laughs> it's a cowbell from China. Crazy. Okay, next box, bedding. Um, not really sure what I have in here. And this is interesting. I actually took the time to write the inventory of what's in the box on the inside of the box lid. Not really sure why I did that. But um, I'm excited because it looks like I have saved some towels, which I desperately need. <laughs> so part of the funny thing about all this unpacking is if you ever really wanted to know what was going on in 2006 in the New York Times, I've got all of the, uh, <laughs> the papers. So one of the things that I was a little bit worried about having in storage for 10 years and then transported out here was my grandmother's china. And luckily, I actually found the box, got it all out today, and everything miraculously survived, except for one little piece. So not bad. As I've been unpacking things, one of the funny things is I found that I have an excessive amount of some things, like USB sticks. And plug adapters. And a few external hard drives. Okay, I found a box with all my old mole skins of just taking notes on various trips and using them for writing. They're really colorful. It'll be fun. It's fun to just open a page and see what I wrote. Okay, all I'm doing is washing dishes. I swear to God, I've got dishpan hands. <laughs> so I've been unwrapping everything from the boxes and it was all in newspaper. And so now all I'm doing is washing dishes, dishes, dishes.